So hi guys, my name is Jalice and this is Infinite Modesty Design. Of course, we are a Toronto sewing and fashion studio and we teach you how to sew both in studio and online. Now, we do um, launch our dressmaking online um, class. Def and I will give you a link in the description below. We teach you or we coach you how to make your own dress online, step by step. Uh, uh, you could definitely contact if you want to find out more about our dressmaking online uh, classes. Now, in this video, we will be showing you how to um, make a seam so that's pretty much it or this is called a seam allowance now some of my questions some of the question I get asked is that what is a seam allowance so the seam allowance now is the distance between the stitch line so this is the stitch line here and the edge of course of the fabric when you sew to, uh, when you sew probably more than uh, maybe one or more pieces of fabric together all right, so that's pretty much it's called a seam allowance. So for in this sphere, I have at least half an inch seam allowance. There's one inch seam allowance. There is three inch seam allowance. There's quite of an inch seam allowance. So all different, um, uh, different type of seam allowance. Now, how do you determine the seam allowance on your pattern? Now, some commercial pattern actually come with standard size five eight seam allowance. That's what I have done. Um, I'm used previously. Now. We also have our own ready to wear um, sewing pattern and the description is in. Uh, of course, you could check the description to find out more about that. And we will show you how to create your own uh, seam allowance and how to actually get it according to uh, the measurement of your body type. So definitely um, click the link to check out our pattern, our downloadable ready to wear pattern there. All right, so let's go ahead and show you how to get this seam allowance now. What I've done, I have two pieces of fabric here. So this is two pieces of fabric here, all right? And then what I've done, I've just go ahead and pin it down to ensure that the edge of the fabric is straight. Now I would go over to my machine and definitely we will start to sew uh, the seam allowance together. So now to get a beautiful, nice and even seam allowance, you have to determine how much seam allowance you wanna put. Is it quarter of an inch, half an inch, three quarter of an inch, one inch, uh, and so on and so forth. So you would determine based on the guide you have here, or you could also mark it as well on the machine. All right. So for this tutorial, we'll be doing a three quarter of an inch seam allowance. Now, when you're doing your seam allowance, you want to make sure that your eyes remain on the gauge. So basically, this is my gauge right here. So when I'm sewing, my eyes going to be here only because I want three quarter of an inch seam allowance. My eyes would not be on the machine or on the needle. So sewing is like driving. This is the road and I want to be straight on the road. I don't want to cause any accidents. So my eyes would be on the road. This is like the wheel or something to help me to go about itself to get um, my project going or to get me to that uh, safe destination. So our eyes would only be here because we want a three quarter of an inch seam allowance. So first we will start with our back stitch. We'll start sewing and then we'll do our back stitch. So I'll take off my first pin here. Then I'm just going to do a little back stitch to secure the stitch. And then my eyes remain here all through the stitch. I'm not taking my eyes off. It's right there. Then I stop and take off my pin. Then I would continue. My eyes remain here. My fabric is nice and taut. My eyes remain here. So I'm doing it slow because I want you to understand that sewing is, is just like driving. It's all about your guide and the amount of seam allowance you put in your fabric. Alright, so then we're going to stop here, take out our one pin. Alright, so my eyes is there. And what I would ask you is to try, always take your time when you're starting if you're a beginner. And as you go along then it will take up speed. All right, so I achieved my three quarter of an inch seam allowance. Now, I would also do a half an inch seam allowance here on a tissue paper, so you would see as well. So again, I'm gonna start here, this is half an inch, I'm just gonna continue this stitch here. This is just for you to see, so my eye is gonna stay on my half an inch. Let's get a little speed here. My eye is only here, not moving anywhere from there. All right, and I'm just keeping my fabric nice and steady. For the end, I do my back stitch, and this is how you achieve your seam allowance. 
All right, so I hope this video uh, is helpful. Definitely take, check out the link in the description below to find out more about our services. And if you want to purchase our ready-to-wear sewing pattern and take our dressmaking online class, definitely contact us. Thanks again. This is Jalice at Infinite Modesty Design. Take care, guys.